I see what you're doing, and I like it. I get hot. Huh? I like that. Double A. We uh, let's explain to everybody what we got going on here. We this is the bull cage, which is where all the fighting bulls are. Everybody's following along. That's where we gather. Where all the big boys are. We're trying to teach Tyler. How We're to keeping cut. Tyler. Simple math, simple math of how to cut cedar stays a little bit taller than he is. So he's on the chainsaw, cutting stays. Me and Double A are on the diggers slash wire crew, and uh, yeah, getting ready for some nation calves. This bull rider is a set to duck. That bull sees him, got him in the sights, and Cody Webster breaks that bull. Pick his head up. That's properly tamped with a proper tamp bar. It's a shame we got Frank's big tamp bar here. I know, I need to go up there and grab it. Frank built us a really nice tamp bar. It's a legit tamp bar that's up there on the welder. But uh, look at here, look at this. Looks like a snake crawling back under the fence. I don't know, I think somewhere about that. That's what I Looks good to me. Tuck boots these days, too. It is, we've been getting some rain, huh? We're not, we're not gonna brag on him though. Hard to get any work out of Tyler. And then you take the stay. Tyler just cut it. If it was me, I think, uh, that's how John Wayne would have done it in the movies, in real life, if he wasn't in a movie. But, this is how the West was built, I'll tell you that much. Buy beef. Beef. Our fighting bulls. Do something. Almost complete. On the old fence here. Set of young kids already hanging out. More nation calves to come. We're gonna wrap it up for today. Go get a workout in. This is to be continued. Well, wild PJ showed up. We uh, got one heck of a rain last two days. So we are kind of on pause, but not really because uh, today, Thursday, uh, they are showing up with everything from the feedlot. So getting the fence completed, uh, getting the bunks finished, now we gotta do a little bit of sorting. We got some heifers caught that are going where all the bulls are going now. So we gotta get them caught, moved, sorted. Uh, a couple young bulls that's been up in the trap just getting fed every day. Uh, we're gonna get them sorted, get them kicked out with the rest of everything in the bull cage. And we're gonna do it horseback because it is uh, quite muddy. What do you say? Uh, yes, sir. Be a little better deal riding. Yeah, I don't really want to be a foot. I don't want to be a foot either. <laughs> Do much oblige you uh, brushing old Carl because he usually doesn't get that kind of treatment. He, uh, I don't know, he's definitely earned it, but still a little bit early for me. No, I'm just kidding. I'll brush him if he needs it, but popcorn's looking good. Bad as a tick. Like I pulled off Ike's ear a while ago, huh, bub? Huh? Man, you're getting old, Ike. Got some gray showing, bro. What do you reckon? Yeah, the old tack shack. What do you think about the old tack shack? It's been good. It's been a good one, huh? That's just kind of a storage part, but... Anyways. Really not looking forward to getting out and tromping around in this stuff. It's gotta be done. Oh, got things pushed up. Uh, gonna do a little sorting. That bull needs his horns tipped. And uh, the rest of the stuff that's looking really good. We got the new bunks in with the new feed. So we're gonna get these younger bulls that are kind of caught up looking better to go out with the rest of the bulls. That way they can get on that really good feed and start really growing. Uh, it is muddy. 
it is a slick hazard but you do not want to work these things a horseback when you get in tight quarters so we are going to do the foot nice gate there pj Man, oh man. That's a little man. Little yeah, he's for real, Bup. That's a fighting bull for you. Mm. Mm -hmm. This bull here has got a really big abscess. Uh, started right there on the side of his face you can kind of see it we took him to the vet multiple times he's had different antibiotics uh stuff run through him and the vet told us that pretty much that growth has turned it's, it's bone now and it's going to just turn into basically uh just going to continue to grow it might get down so we uh we're just going to practice on him get some use out of him go from there Gangs begins. We're about to stir up the neighborhood. Oh boy. I don't know if you can really hear the audio, but I mean, this is the sounds and sights of a fighting bull ranch. Weather changes, weather snaps, green grass, putting new inmates in the cell it uh gotta get the pecking order back down and they will definitely they'll figure it out but it uh it gets pretty loud some nights some days and definitely when we have a full-on bullfight it gets spooky all the nice little young bulls they're gonna go with the bulls that are coming from the feedlot. Good looking little rascals. C7 looks like a bucking bull, don't he? <laughs> Jeez, what a day. Everybody's situated. He was pretty tough when he was in the pens. Now look at him. Fight nobody. Everybody's settled in. All we're waiting on is a truck with a whole bunch of hooky in it. Exciting day. I'm ready to see these things. It's been months since I've seen them. I think it's gonna be a pretty, pretty neat side. I think they're gonna really, really look good. Well, there's a sign. That's the one we've been after. Two days in the works and uh, 11 o'clock at midnight. Well, we are getting geared up. Get these things kicked off in the back pins. Deal with the rest of them tomorrow. Well, you made it, Super Trucker. Sure did. Old Black Betty still has it in. Old Black Betty still got it going on, huh? Oh, Rob. Rob has uh, just become the Flying W full-time trucker. It's only other way now to put it. <laughs> Not as well, Everybody falling along, feed bunks, cattle hauling. This man does it all. And he sells real estate. So imagine him and Smash being friends. Weird <laughs> deal. Uh, man, I think just come in and we'll, we'll just kind of cut us a trail towards the shop, stay on that gravel. And then that gate that's straight right there okay. i'm gonna open it up and we'll just back up right into them pins that way we don't get stuck okay. i like to help you but you just told me you got it so got it. i'll let it be this time. you know we're just making things happen here at the flying w that's how it goes
Ain't no feeling like cow mobiling. And get these things kicked out rob thanks for the trucking yep get these kicked out we'll see you in the morning oh good morning everybody back out got some sunshine uh something to deal with these animals is a little bit of daylight so you know what you're doing you can see what's going on especially when they're sharp uh here comes the old horses easy banks easy easy does it KJ, the wild man, he's back. He didn't want to miss the action. We uh, get a horse back again. That way we ain't got to tromp around in this old uh, mud. Connor's got the gray horse rocking and rolling. Hey, look out there, old son. Yeah, man. Uh, we're well on. Uh, what ride is this? Oh, 45 days now. 35. 35. 40 days somewhere in there so old gray is coming around for everybody that's commenting on youtube well who's the blind cowboy who's the one on a runaway horse well he was on his 12th day riding should he have been on that horse no did we think things were going to escalate and get where it did no hey, but did it better. yes they don't get that's no what better. happens look out fella huh. so uh everybody that's that's hating better. everybody that wants to think they can do better on a fighting bull ranch hey put an application in well We'll see where we're at. Don't let him get by you, KJ. Oh, I better catch my horse. I can assure you. Oh, well, hello there, baby cat. I can assure you that uh, that's not the one you want to be dealing with one o'clock in the morning, in the mud, no lights, and not the best pins. The best pins are over there. These are not the best pins, but we made it work. Hello, Nina. That nation's looking good, ain't he? Woo wee! Here, now quit. Why do you want to be so mean all the time? Huh? Man, there is a whole entire pin full of hook it right there, PJ. Huh? Yes, sir. Don't look half bad, do they? Yes, sir. They look pretty good, really, considering. And an all night drive. And sloppy, sloppy, muddy pins. Thank you, Carl. There comes some more. Well, that paint looks good, don't he? Come on, man. Come on. Think about it. Think about it. Don't hook us. There you go. That's cool. Huh? Yep. Yep. Get around. Get around. Come on. Hey, kids. Hey, kids. Good. 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 Boys are looking good, ain't they? I really like this bald face. He's out of the pretty sure he's out of that practice cow that we fought so much, the black and white face. Yeah. Looking good. You know, if Huck Boots, anybody's watching this, uh, we believe in your products. So. Holler at the W. <laughs> they get used often. That's Ranch Ray's right there, buddy. Woo! A2. <laughs> hey, 
<laughs> Boy, I like that B16. Mm. Couple C's right there. It has turned into a fighting bull factory fast. Let's go, boys. Come on. Come on. Come on. He'll go over there. Come on, buddy. Easy. This is Black Betty. Uh, this is the cow that's knocked out a couple of the students. Knocked out Trenton. Knocked out, she's knocked out two or three different people. That's, that's a calf right there, the baldy. Growing too, KJ. Woo. B22 is still one of my favorites though. He has that A5 look. Let's worm them little guys. Like it? Yep. Yeah, this, this is B11. This is a little bull that when we first got him back from the first feedlot, uh, we kicked him out, worked him, and then he went out there and started hooking them horses, and uh, Feller knocked him out. Double uppercut him, knocked him out. And then a little bit later, I was working out in the shop. Somehow he got around between the shop and everything. When I walked out the door, this thing, I mean, almost smokes me, dude. I just put a Hail Mary on and missed me. Like, I'm talking, it was crazy. Cody Gertson was here. We went round and round a hay bonk that I was putting together out in the yard. B11. He got knocked out, so I call him Day Day. They'll, they'll all fit. <laughs> PJ just sneaking around with that warmer. I see what you're doing and I like it. Also a product placement, you know. Uh, if anybody watching comes across a company that deals in hydraulic chutes, um, I don't know, uh, hit us up because we like what we do. We like to live, but at the end of the day, you got to just do what you got to do. So, you know, props to a company that wants to get aboard the Flying W train. Let us know we're uh, we're in the market. When you say, He's getting fired up fast. B16. <laughs> I'm gonna have to get him on the next flight. And then when we get somewhere to an event, we're not tearing everybody's stuff up. Which is the first thing to get you run off. Quit, quit. Oh, I like you're a bad dog, I know. Huh? It's just little. Yep. I guess there is a good chance of him. Being a three-year-old, he's just little. Completely full blood, huh?
still he's still a year out from being able to use him and he's mean don't get me wrong Did you get the They ain't tried to put me on the fence once yet. They just they handle. They look for a hole. They know a gate. They move. Everything about them is good. I'm I'm really liking what we got going on. As far as fuel, learning how to handle, learning the gate, learning to move, load, unload. Last night was just going into them old pins. Nothing's good about it. Uh. You know, I really wondered like ahead of time, like if messing with these calves when we're weaning them and getting a handle on them, showing them what, you know, showing them through the pen, showing them how to sort, how to load. Uh, I really wondered if it was gonna be something that backfired on us and is, uh, you know, down the road gonna be something that would hinder us from them fighting. But, and I think we're, I think we're spot on the money of having something that handles, that knows its job and that's to fight. Kind of neat how that horn is regrowing at the base of that thing. 201. <sighs> Y'all handle that. I'm gonna show YouTube what uh what this feed process is looking like. So these are the bunks we've all put in. Everybody's followed along. It's a feed wagon and the feed man. Right. What do you say, partner? I'm all right. Oh, it's a good day. Everything's here. Oh, they came in, okay. Last night about one o'clock. If you want to, we can start. If you got enough, if not, then we'll Well, I've got a little extra on today. We'll figure it out. Yeah, if you got some extra, uh Everybody that's been following along, they know you because we've been talking about you. We built the bunks. Uh -oh. Everything's going. This is the man behind feeding the meanest critters on the W. And uh, to be quite honest with you, it's been working pretty good, to say the least. But uh, hell of a setup. It took some work, but it's working good. All just augers right out of there. Boom. Yeah. Pretty good stuff. Yeah, mix feed right there. That's a good mix of corn, Wet the distiller's sewers, grain, molasses, molasses, hay, a complete supplement to hook your ass. Handmade forms turning out all right. Aha. Just like we dreamed it. Different game dealing with these big boys. They uh, a little different game, ain't they? The heat is there. Oh, oh, quit, 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 quit. Get off of me. Think about it. Think about it. Think about it. Think about it. Oh, oh, oh. Quit. 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 Let me go up. Come on. Come on, A5. Come on. Come on. There you go. Whee! Them big boys, we don't want to turn out with the rest of the herd because where they're going on this side of the trap, uh, where the second set of bunks is uh there is a fence line that's not a uh, pipe we put a bunch of stays in stretch of wire tight but there is a set of cows so we're kind of using that side for all the calves real young bulls that really won't be out 
trying to go to breed cows. So uh, they will go in the bull cage. The rest of them will go to what we're calling the calf pen. I don't, yes, about, I don't know if Kaz is the right name because young men. The young men is where we're going to put them. Wow. That baldy wants to go. Look at here. Look at here. Have some common sense there, you two. Take them through the hole. Let's go. Hey, hey. Hey, hey. I think we're winning. There we are. You bet. Ride that donkey. <laughs> uh, I didn't hit record, but we got the end of it. We cannot get out of the arena. They will not leave. There we go. Put the big loop on him, PJ. Yeah, he did. Come on to the hole. Gate, Connor. How about JJ? All right, we're good. Nice catch. Hey, 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 hey. Take it. Oh, rope's gone. Ready? All you had to do is just go. You had him. Connor, be ready to get on that cut gate, Buck. I think it's coming. Oh, he's mad, huh? Yeah, he's mad. Cut gate, boys. Cut gate. Keep riding, KJ. Let's go for a little ride here, guys. Come on, KJ. Here we come. Dental up, dental up, dental up, dental up, Woo! Woo! Well, guys, nothing better than a fighting bull chasing you. Just want to say thanks for tagging along. Uh, some big movements going on right here at the W fighting bulls ranching bull fighting uh everything that we like doing and love doing taking this little guy to the herd from us to you be sure to like subscribe give us a follow from our crew to your crew salute dude if you'll just give it up man you can go to the herd bro you can go to the herd they're literally all standing right here dude let's get him mike let's get by hey let's get by there right there get out come here nina there nina all right coy come here come here there we go